if you just came off the last video that was an hour and 15 minutes long, then I don't know how you got through that. And I also don't know how I got through that. I just played three games of Catan with these same guys, and they keep rematching. And I'm a sucker for rematches. So we're running it back. I'm exhausted. But we got a fourth new guy, so now we're going to mix it up a bit. And let's see what we can do here. Okay, let's start it up, Nika. Okay, brand new video for this game. Just got to announce it. I'm going to split them up in two. There's no way I could put four games in a row. I was already at an hour and 15 on that last video. I could not do it. It was crazy. I'm not going to spoil them exactly how they went. I don't know if I actually spoiled them just earlier, but... This time we're getting fourth pick again. So not much to look at right now. These two, Shutas and Nico, I've been hearing it. He said, please, if you can finish it, finish it. Don't waste the time. What is he going on about? Yeah, that spot got taken. Okay. Well, um, what looks good here? Brickport looks awesome. Oh, I get to pick twice in a row. So do I want free road, maybe? Free road strats. Where is Sheepport at? Oh, Sheepport also looks really good. But I might play straight on the three for one port instead of the Sheepport. Three for one port, and then get the free road and build up to the brick port. Ooh, I could also go down to this eight ore later. That's a play for later, I think. The eight ore is a play for later. I want this brick port. My numbers are solid. Oh, no, I made a mistake. I made a fat mistake. No way Grace has to fight me for this brick port. There's, uh, there's no reason for him to. Yeah, he's not. Okay, he just wants brick in general. Ooh, he, Greg can get a connected road here. That'll be nice for him. Um, I didn't realize the mistake until I just did it, but when I played, I played on the 8 and the 6, and that's all I looked at. But I'm also on the 4 and the 3 on this spot, and the 4 and the 3 on this spot. So this game's going to be rough. Wait, three num 1, 2, 3, 4 numbers. This game is either going to go perfectly or horribly. Because either my numbers pop, like, pop off, or no, like, just the fact that threes and fours roll. I'm going to be so reliant on threes that it's going to be ridiculous. The good thing, though, is that my four number has sheep and wheat, right? Oh, that three for one four got blocked. Okay, well... It wasn't absolutely necessary, but it's unfortunate, though. I'm not excited about it. I wish I built that road down then, I guess, or to the right for the sheep port, but it's okay. Yeah, it looks like green's going for that eight ore spot. I was really wanting to go there. Um... Four. Okay, at least fours are rolling, but we need a three, really. A three would give us a road settlement first turn, actually. We're not getting it, though. I'm not really crazy. Okay, I got blocked. I lost the wheat. That's fine. I didn't absolutely need it. Gray got a victory point off that. Eight. Ah, darn. That's not... That's not fun. Okay. 
just got to go for the brick port right away. That'll be my saving grace with the ore for sure. I'm going to be right back on a video. I'm going to have to end that for a second. Wow, I missed it on two eights. Crazy. I just realized right now that, okay, there we go. We actually have the, we got a three rolling. Okay, this might not be too bad if our numbers roll. Okay, we can't get seven dollars. Yeah, so we got a guaranteed settlement right here. Nice. Okay, now we have our win condition here and we're gonna need Wow, three's actually rolling. No way. No way three's rolling. Okay, I got blocked there, that's unfortunate. Sheep for ore, probably no chance, but if I build it up to two sheep for two ore. Probably not, okay, yeah, that's expected. I'm really just hoping for a 7 to roll right now. Because I'm hurting without that break port. Ah, that's a free card going away. 7, there we go. At least I rolled it too. What do we block? Um, I might want to slow down green in case I want to go down for this spot. I can't trade away my sheep, so it's not even worth trying. Huge block, let's go. This board is dry on brick now, so everyone should be pretty slow. I can possibly still get off of this spot now. Wow, I just completely messed up green there. He could have had two roads to build down here and possibly get a settlement so if he trades some of his extra brick. That really screwed him up. I'm fine with the robber. Oh, no, the robber moved there, though. That's terrible. Can we stop blocking that? I mean, I'm not even getting my sixes. Oh, let's go. He moved it right back. Gotta put a little heart in the chat for that. Whoa, no chance. It's <laughs> the joke trade. It's like a brick for four wood with the actual players instead of the bank. Ten, not what we needed, but something. Sheep for wood could be good. Cause once one six fools were chilling here, we really gotta thank whoever used that knight to save us. Oh, sheep for wood, let's go. I don't desperately need sheep for wood, but if I get a six to roll, then I'm really gonna want it. Well, I, I'm so happy you put that robber back on the five. It's really slowing down green for getting the settlement down here, and it's going to give me a chance to snag it. 
Because getting on that 8th spot could be make or break for me. And I could possibly even double up on it. And it would just be a longest road attempt as well. It's just a masterful spot to get to. And it would also be connected to my 8 wheat. But I don't get my hopes up too. Oh, you know what? If I can build two roads this way, so if a six rolls on my turn, I can actually cut green off and go for it. Okay, Gray got largest army. That's all he has though. Oh, he kicked that off to five. That's not too great. Twelve. Okay, that's not a six. Just no fives roll. Okay, seven rolled. Do we put it back on the five brick or do we screw me over? Five brick, please. Or just not my six bricks. Don't block my brick. Yes, 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 yes. That's so unbelievably good. Now all we need is just one five or one six to roll. I kind of feel bad for green because I mean, if I were green, I would be kind of frustrated. What did I lose? I lost a sheep or a wheat, that's fine. Just give me a six this turn so I can block off green. That's all I want. Yes, 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 yes. I didn't think I was gonna actually get it, but I got it. Oh, wait, I'm missing a wood. No, I may have just thrown the game now. No. Yes. Thank you guys. I thought I had that wood still. I genuinely thought I had it, but apparently I didn't. I guess that's what I got robbed off of. That's why you gotta measure twice and cut once. You can't, you can't be making silly mistakes like that. I gave away my intentions. And green, yeah, green was building roads backwards right after that. He could have blocked me off that one road that I wasted. And that could have been a detrimental tempo to lose there. I mean, Gray can also cut me off back here. But with his low brick production, I think the odds are slim. He probably wants to just go for this settlement as fast as possible. Give me some ore, dude. I know you have eight. Yeah, there you go. I probably could have asked for two ore, but... I'm satisfied with one ore. And get a nice dev card off that, possibly. Gives me a road building, would be nice. Knights can always be good, useful to save me. Five, dude. That robber on the five is so. I feel so bad for green. Because I just can't imagine being in that position. It's like you have such a good number, it's rolling like crazy, it's a connected road. You could have been dominating if it wasn't blocked, and it just keeps getting blocked. So, I definitely feel for the man, it's rough, it's not, it's definitely rage inducing right there, it's not the most fun, but, you know what? It's the ruthless game. What is, how does he have so much ore? Oh, he's asking for that much ore, right? Oh, he's on the 9 with the city. That explains it. Blue will have a nice game with that wood port there. He's just having a slow start. Nothing to do. No! 
this little karma right here was happy that he was getting screwed over the fives and now I'm getting a bit screwed with a six. Or at least the robber moved off it really fast. But I've lost my ore there too. That's what I was really frustrated about, losing the ore there. We could get a road settlement uh, soon. If we can get a trade for wood. You got a six to roll. Six. Okay, there we go. Wait a second. Sheep for wheat. Sheep for wood. Sheep wheat for wood. Oh, no, I got that trade. Okay. Road. Settlement. And we're happy. I was definitely willing to give him more there, but decided against it. Oh, I keep telling myself I'm going to get off sugar, but I keep eating so much, or so many, of these chocolate almonds. They're just so good. Irresistible. Yep, no trades I can take there. That 8 spot will be game changing. I'm probably going to lose the longest road here. Don't think my chances are keeping that too high. We got some brick there. I forgot I have brick for it. I might be using that. But three doesn't roll soon. I don't know what it is about AirPods, but they're just so easy to lose. If you do not put them right back in the case, they disappear. They're like socks. Pretty much. You just... Lose one of them and they're gone for a while. Four, okay, we take it. But what are we gonna do with it? Dev card, sure. Big three point, definitely better for me to have it than someone else. So that was definitely worth it because, I mean, someone else could have gotten that victory point and it could have been detrimental to this game. Ten has been rolling like crazy. I've been getting lucky, though, with the dice stats. I wonder what they are. I don't know if I can see them from here, though. I think we have to wait till the game ends. Yep, there goes Longest Road. Oh, wait a second, though. That's good. I thought Green and Gray were the same person for whatever reason. They were going to get Road and Army at the same time. Don't know why, but that's what my head was thinking. Okay, now we don't want development cards. We want or. I wish I had wood, dude. You don't even understand. I'd be willing to give you the settlement if I could just get, have... Three is not rolling good. I don't have it. I mean, six is good for me. Eight's good for me. I would rather have eight, though. Okay, I didn't get either. What do we block here? Five rolls like crazy. That's generally a good block. Who has ore? Gray has ore. Yes. 
That was a good steal. I remember that Gray got ore from here. I doubt that Gray trades in the yeah, okay. Makes sense. But we're one step closer to a city. That was good. I kept that tracking in my head of who had what. Yeah, I'm not interested. Was that a dev card buy? What did he do? He did two wood for an ore, so he two for one to another ten. No way. Oh, I forgot. Ten's actually even better than I thought it was because he gets the two for one. His resources off that. That's crazy. Okay, let's play here, right? Just increase our brick production, I guess. Even though the ore spot might be nice, er, want to hold off on that idea just for now. We're going to want to build up on ore. We don't need as much brick. It'll also condense our cards down. Maybe we can go for a road road settlement for sheep port or for the wheat port. I'm leaning towards going for wheat port and then building another city up here. That's my idea right now. Three again, I was hoping for a six, but we do take those, just no sevens in the next two turns. It doesn't really matter what rolls as long as seven doesn't roll. Oh wait, I'm good to put my face cam back on now. Let me fix it up though, I think I'm too close to it. Yeah, way too close to it, there we go. Yeah, seven ended up rolling. I suppose we just toss a bunch of wood. We can toss some sheep and we produce quite a bit of wheat, so we'll hold on to some of that wood there. Definitely block the nine here. That's a big block from me. Oh, I didn't get the robber. Well, that works for me as well. Block the six, sure. Eleven. Not what I was looking for. I say we dev card here. We've got a knight. The knight's not bad, but largest army's out the window, so it's not exactly what I wanted. Okay, we're getting closer to a city. We could have had one extra ore from not using the dev card, but I think we should still be able to get it, though. We get the right rolls here. Ten, ten is not the right roll. Who has ore? Okay, so if eight rolled... Gray has ore. What did he do? He stole wheat from me. Did he? Oh, he used the robber. Let me use a robber then. I guess this robber does come in clutch. Did Gray use his ore? Gray didn't use his ore, so I'm going to steal from him again. I didn't get his ore off him, though. Which is unfortunate. Five. Not excited about that. Sheep for ore, I guess, but there's no way it goes through. I'll try wood for ore. I, I know someone wanted wood earlier. But yeah, probably not now. Okay, let's just do that. Buy another dev card. Got another knight. It's whatever. I think having the knight for defensive purposes is good. Even though I use an ore, I just had too many cards in my hand. And I would have had five cards. Would have had a high chance of breaking out six there we go let's get a three now three or eight i'm also happy with an eight but three is ideal because we can go for a road road settlement possibly come on six or no three that yeah three is what i wanted oh and three gives me the sheep too so i do have the road road settlement this turn but i just need Yeah, no, I'm good. Okay, he has no dev cards to steal my sheep off me. Okay. I don't know what I have to do to not have a 7 roll, but just please, please game. Eight. Okay, eight's huge.
We'll leave the robber there. It's a good spot for it. Okay, now our next idea is a city here. That'll put us at eight points. I think the robber is mainly for defensive purposes now. There's no point in using it offensively. Getting a city here will give me a city almost every single turn, so I could possibly win this game really fast, but yeah, not with blocks like that. What did I lose? Oh, he stole a card from Nico. Okay, we're down for that. Oh, because I have six points up to their eyes. Green might have nine points. Uh, knight right away. I got to block green though, right? Steal from green, I guess. Does green have ore though? Gray might have ore. No, he didn't. Whoa, what is that spam about? Don't I have the two for one port? Yeah, I do. Another city. I mean, this two for one wheat port should be really nice, but let's get another ore to build up for some cities in the future. Oh, yeah. He's trying to clear the chat. That's, I was wondering what he was doing. But I guess he's trying to clear the chat out so no one thinks he has a VP. That's a funny strategy, just spamming chat. <laughs> that's hilarious. Okay, yeah, you see, that's why I traded the two wheat for an ore there, because I knew that uh, cause I only get produced two ore each time. So now I only needed one roll to come through for me. So now I got another city. I suppose it goes here. Only place that makes sense. Brick for wheat would be nice. Brick for ore. Can I take longest road, actually? Wait a second. Longest road's viable. Oh, wait. Brick for wheat. Okay, we buy dev card here. Hope for victory point. Ah, okay. I can take longest road, actually, off him and win the game. Okay, he lost seven cards there. Wow, he had 14 cards. Um, You know, I don't know... If I could have maybe traded for Longest Road, maybe that was a better strategy to go for first. Who did I trade with, actually? I traded with... I traded with the Hebrew. Okay, that's fine. I don't know why he traded when he had 14 cards, though. That doesn't make too much sense to me. The problem with taking Longest Road, though, is that it is not going to be long-lasting. Yeah, that gets blocked. That sucks. Um, the one upside right here is that I have this Year of Plenty, which I can get a city off of. Just gotta hope he doesn't win this turn. Did he win? Okay, no, he solidified Longest Road, but the good thing is I didn't need that as a position. So as long as he doesn't... Yeah, he's, oh, his turn's done. Okay, wait, that might be game. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3... Year of Plenty, Two Wheat, City, GG well played. I'll put a City here on the Ore, or actually on the 6-2, that's funnier. Bro, we got three wins in a row, you guys didn't, oh, I kind of spoiled the other video then. Well, hopefully you watch that one first, I'll put this one out way later then. Like, look how close that was. <laughs> I said GG three times. <laughs> Just spamming the GG. So I'm like, ah, GG with a question mark. Oh, GG well played. And then, oh, GG's. And then he said GG's. So I guess I put a fourth one. He said he messed up with the roads on three to four. Do you not know what GG means, or do you just wonder why I'm spamming it? 
He said he messed up with these roads. I, I don't know if he means he didn't want to go out wide or... I don't know. Like, he... I think what he means is that, like, okay, he has 14 roads. He's going to change his name. Oh, does he want to rematch again? I think I'm done. I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. Hope you enjoyed it. What would you have done differently in this game? I mean, what, what else is there to do? Just let me know in the comments down below. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, all the good stuff. And have a good one. See you in the next one.